Hi, this is Matthew Mayer from QuickRegister.net, and today I'm going to talk about Google Places and why Google Places is so important for your business, especially if you have a local business. Uh, right now, uh, about 20% of Google searches are local searches. That means there's a local qualifier uh, for searches. So for say, for example, I was in San Francisco and I wanted to take a yoga class. Okay. I'm not in San Francisco. I'm not looking to take a yoga class, but let's just say I was. You know, I might go either on the internet with on my computer, or maybe even more likely, I would be on my smartphone and I would type in a Google search, yoga, San Francisco. Okay, let's see what happens. Now, what happens is, okay, I have a sponsored listing here. That's great with a bunch of reviews but here in the natural listings I've got this uh, listing for yoga garden and I've got a click to call here a bunch of reviews from Yelp and city search a lot of information and over here is something which says place page okay now this is a special page made by Google for this business and what Google has done they have made over 50 million web pages for local business because Google realizes there are so many searches now for local businesses. Most local businesses rely on their customers being like five miles from them. All their customers are located within five miles from them, or at least most of them. Google recognizes this and wants it to make it wants to make it easier for people to find local businesses, and they've done actually a fantastic job. Okay, so there's 50 million pages out here about local businesses, uh, and only about four million of these businesses have actually claimed the pages and started to enhance them with pictures and videos and coupons and extra information. So if you have a local business, go check uh, Google, see if you have one already and claim it and start adding to it. Now we can take a look here. Now we have for the Yoga Garden of San Francisco, we've got a click to call phone number. If I was looking at this from a cell phone, I would be able just to click here and call. This goes right to my Skype. How handy. I just have to click once and it'll call there. If I want directions, I've got this is coordinated with Google Maps. Click here. Go to Google Maps. Get directions. Okay. All kinds of reviews. Not just the reviews on Google, but also reviews on from aggregated from other local directories. Yelp.com, CitySearch.com. I've never even heard of this one. There's lots of them. All aggregated here giving a, you know a, you quite a bit of information on this business I mean we've got pictures these are all from the owner okay so this person has actually taken the time to modify their page and add to it uh, more reviews down here uh, some service details hey you can get free maps at this yoga school this is all kind of in, uh, information this local business owner has been very smart to put on his Google Places page and you can do this for your local business as well and it's free. You can also do mobile coupon codes or people can just uh, show their uh, uh, mobile code and get discounts and so forth. Also this page is automatically optimized for mobile phones. It's very important because everyone is searching now on their mobile phone. I mean When's the last time you used the yellow pages? I mean, the yellow pages are dead. This is how people are looking for businesses. So if your local business is not on Google Places, you're losing business. So what you need to do is go do a search for Google Places. You can find out quickly on how to you know, claim your page, or you can go to my blog post, quickregister.net, and do a search there. I have a link where you can find up uh, uh, find out. You know, where to claim your Google Places page, then start uploading videos, photos, extra information about your page. Maybe uh, do a, a coupon, a mobile coupon code that you can give away to your people. Maybe start incentivizing uh, people to write reviews. If people say, hey, they like your service, hey, you know, I'll give you 10% off if uh, we see that you've written a review about us. Okay, I mean, you don't tell them to write a good one or a bad one, but most likely you're going to say to the people who enjoyed the service, uh, uh, you're going to recommend that they go out and 
write a review for for you and just to incentivize them a little bit to actually take the effort to do so well give them a little discount that's just an idea uh, because the more reviews you have the higher you get ranked in the Google organic listings and these uh, Google places pages are often coming up above uh, other organic listings especially when you're doing a local search you're putting in yoga San Francisco yoga New York or Chinese restaurants Topeka Kansas you get the idea uh, I hope this video is helpful for you it's just a brief introduction to Google places go and claim your Google places page now start modifying modifying it adding to it and uh, I would appreciate your comments in the comments area thank you so much Matthew Mayer quickregister.net